right off the top. Important to note, Taylor Soul is the one who has the defensive assignment on Angel Reese. Roger Johnson tried to flip it up, could not. The follow from Williams does roll in. Here is Alexis Morris. You heard Holly break down her redemption story back to the tutelage of Kim Mulkey. Fired that up too strong. Reese on the offensive glass. There it is again. And look at Kane come from behind. And Reese nearly picked up a second foul. Amor off the mark. Offensive rebound. Kinley puts it in. Down in transition. It really benefits LSU to do so. But here, Liz Kinley, the biggest player on the floor. Six. But another offensive rebound. Knocked away by Williams. LSU now in transition. Morris, nice move to the hoop and the finish. Explosive, and LSU as a team thrives when they get out in transition. Here she comes down the floor. Amor just plays Ole defense, lets her get to the bucket. This is a young woman who is potent offensively, great in the mid-range. For Kitley, she has four of Virginia Tech six points, and Trailer able to take away the dribble for Morris. Sets up Reese, guarded by Soul. Reese leans in, can't finish it, and Soul after it for Virginia Tech. That shoots 45% on the season, 35% from three. You would expect at some point their shots start to fall. Amor says, how about now, Miss Lobo? Poa inbounding. Gets it into Morris. Bunny jumper is good. Alexis Morris has provided the offense. They've gone heavy to her so far early in this one. Here's Reese getting the post up. Oh, Reese able to shed Greg and reverse it in. Carson draws two, gets it out to Williams. Ladeja Williams spinning, taking and hitting. 20 to 13, LSU in front. Amor. Looking to wheel away from Morris. Amor, a deep three is good. Well, she's slippery, but she's also strong. She got a loss against Tennessee in the SEC championship game. And after that, she said, I felt like I let my team down. So she has been working hard. And you see another three there, Drain. She said, Angel Reese is bigger and stronger than she was two weeks ago. Because she is not going to let her team down again. And she's put up big results in this tournament, as has Alexis Flores. It's for LSU, who have to perform in this game. And they certainly have so far. Trailer turns the corner and lays it in. And now Virginia Tech starting to hum offensively. That's the descriptive. Right. <laughs> Reese. Cups it in, so LSU takes advantage. This is the second pull, the offensive rebound. Williams hops inside and gets the roll. Adasia Williams turns it into a three-point possession. Kitley gets it back, draws two. Spins, Kitley able to force it in. Eight points, five boards for the 2,000-point score. Oh, what a spin from Reese. Reese, two possessions ago, takes it right at her, and then... Gatiri Poole, the Bronx native. Ahead to Morris. Morris looking to take Amor. She does. Looking to push for Virginia Tech. Pull up three, won't go. Kitley, the offensive rebound. Kitley trying to force it in and does staying between Alexis Morris and the basket. Carson has it knocked away by Trailer. Kayana Trailer trying to beat LSU to the cup. Amor comes back to grab it. Trailer will pull and hit from three. Mojo, it's not just Georgia Amor, Liz Kitley. Trailer getting into the... Here's Poole. Over to Reese, just two rebounds in his first half. Reese spinning, gobbled up by Kitley. Last hit, Reese. Virginia Tech basketball. Okay. If you do the too small symbol when you score, do you do the too big one when you do <laughs> Kitley connects. This game is tied. Using the Greg screen, Amor kicks, low pass. Trailer, the crossover, and the finish. First lead of the Final Four for Virginia Tech. Smith denied by Kitley. 
Flag down by Trailer. A trip to the national championship game Sunday afternoon on the line as King knocks down the three and a good start to the third for the Hokies. Synergy numbers as we take another look at King. And she's so important to their success. She has struggled shooting the basketball of late, the freshman. Trailer bounces inside. Soul finds Kitley, waits and finishes. More than two threes. Kenny Brooks has told us about that and just great patience by Kitley. Those synergy numbers and how rarely Virginia Tech used the zone this season. How about the ability for Kenny Brooks to use it in a moment like this, even though it's not something his team goes at a high rate or efficiently, but can get into the paint. It has to be an option. Williams able to end that scoreless streak as Kitley gets the roll. It sends things over to Holly Rowe. Liz Kitley is very comfortable shooting the fadeaway jumper, and it's something that Kenny Brooks worked with her on because he said there's times where she could get off balance. So got to the good news that she was coming to the Hokies. D3 is good for Alexis Morris. Finds a more. A little too long. Kitley bangs it alive, and King able to flag it down. A more, another good look. She got it. To me, one of the most impressive parts of it is she does not let misses affect her confidence. She started this game missing a couple from the perimeter, continues to now hit more threes than any player in NCAA tournament history. A tournament record for Georgia Amore as we send things over to Holly. Before every single game, Kenny Brooks texts Georgia Amore and said you're the best shooter in the country as Soul gets in on the party. Now she is best in the NCAA tournament, Ryan. She's been huge tonight after a slow start as Morris is doing everything she can. Something we saw when LSU played against South Carolina earlier in the season, one versus two, Alexis Morris was the one who was able to score. For King LSU. again! Virginia Tech is humming now. That foul came on a second chance for LSU. And now with Soul out of the game, can Reese take advantage? She does on that possession. 10 point Virginia Tech lead. Midway through this third. Oh, and here comes Reese on the steal. Angel Reese all the way in for two. Going through individual workouts on the floor with this player, something he loves to do to continue to develop them. Virginia Tech comes up with a steal here. Trailer going to go all the way in and pizza pie at home. Virginia Tech doing an outstanding job boxing her out once shots go up. Morris, the jab step. Goes cross court. Good look here for Poole. She got it. Morris gets it inside. Williams denied by Kitley. Reese on the follow. No foul called. Williams able to finish through the contact. Well, no, but it's my children's tactic when they're not <laughs> looking at me and saying what they want to say under their breath. And it's working. Williams bangs inside and finishes again. Here's Morris. Try to get it inside, Kitley knocked it away, and Virginia Tech covers up for the moment. Virginia Tech trailed by nine midway through the second, then ended the second quarter on an 11-0 run. Started the third hot at a double-digit lead moments ago, LSU has chipped into it. Trailer connects! Meanwhile, Virginia Tech a plus 15 from the three-point line as Morris starts the fourth with a much-needed three for LSU. Morris dives inside and banks it in. Alexis Morris. Virginia Tech keeps that tight six-player rotation. Kayla King on the bench at the moment. Trailer thought about it. Three to shoot. Kitley puts it down in traffic. Could not do that. Into the corner. Johnson dumps it down. Reese into the center of the paint. Hooks it in. Timeout, Virginia Tech. Making an impact to start this fourth. 7-0 beginning to the quarter for LSU as Amor says enough of that run. Something like that. She has hit some big threes tonight when her team has needed it most. Williams face up jumper is true. That's her spot. Oh, the crossover, the kick. Morris airballs it. Pool there. Fired a bullet to Reese. Able to finish. 17 tonight for Kayana Trailer. 
Knocked away. Trailer loses it. Morris dashing into the open floor. Morris into the corner. Shot clock was fading. The steal from Johnson. Johnson gives LSU the lead. Flage with the steal and the push the other way. Four points for the first. A 14 to 3 run. Amor can't hit. Soul flies in. Williams has it. Here come the Tigers. Pool barrels in and finishes. Here's Morris. Little pull up. No. Reese on the offensive glass. Put back won't go. Another chance is good. Here's Reese. Back to work. Gets denied by Kitley. Persistent. Can't flip it in, but gets the whistle. Chip Attack has come out of that zone in the fourth quarter, just having a hard time, no matter what, keeping LSU off the glass. Johnson soars in. Morris slinks through. Morris gets denied by Kitley. Williams has it stripped, but Reese is there for the follow. Amor fires away. No, Soul can't grab it. King has it. King. Has to let it fly, and hits from three. That's a big one. Morris letting it wind inside of a minute. Morris into the paint. Morris lays it in. I mean, she is quick with good handles, gets in. That's not an easy finish, but. A shot at just nine of 31 from three in this game, 29%. Kidley, it looked like she got banged, no call. Stolen by LSU, and that on the back of a massive fourth quarter. LSU is headed to the national championship game for the first time in program history. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.